Hi friends, welcome to another session in my home kitchen. Today I am preparing potato and split gum pakoda curry. It is a very spicy and yummy curry. We need the following ingredients for this recipe. 1 cup split gram or chana dal. 2 boiled potatoes cut into bite size. Paste of 2 medium sized onion. 2 teaspoons ginger garlic and green chili paste. 1 chopped onion. Coriander leaves. 1 cup tomato puree. Half teaspoon of asafoetida or hing. Salt according to your taste. For cooking we need some olive oil. You can use any oil of your choice. Half teaspoon of sugar. We need the following spices. 1 teaspoon of turmeric powder. 1 teaspoon of cumin powder. 1 teaspoon of red chili powder. Half teaspoon of garam masala. We need some vegetable oil for frying pakoras. Let's start our cooking. First we will make pakoda. For this we need to soak the chana dal at least for 3 to 4 hours. Then with cumin seeds and green chili we will make a smooth paste. Already I have made a coarse paste of chana dal, cumin seeds and green chilies. So now I will make pakoda. Put some salt. Add salt according to your taste. Add chopped onion and give it a mix. Put little bit of hing or asafoetida. Mix it properly. I have already heated a pan in my wax station. Oil has become hot. Now I will make pakoda. Fry till the color is changes into golden brown. Now the pakoda is ready. We will keep the pakoda on a paper towel. So that all the excess oil will be soaked by the paper towel. I have already heated a pan in my wax station. Put 2 teaspoon of oil. Here I am using olive oil. Oil has become hot. Now onion paste goes into it. Cook the onion for 5 to 6 minutes so that all the water will be evaporated. Some ginger garlic paste goes into it. Give it a mix and cook it for 3 to 4 minutes. Add tomato puree. Mix it properly. Cook it for 5 minutes. Add all the spices, turmeric powder, red chilli powder and garam masala. Give it a mix. Add sugar. 
salt according to your taste. Put little bit of water. Cook it for two to three minutes. Now we'll add potato pieces. Give it a mix. Add two cups of boiled water. Cover the lid and cook till it boils. Now the gravy is boiling. We'll add cocodas. Now I'll put chopped coriander leaves and green chilli. Give it a mix. Now we are almost done. I am going to switch up the stove. Curry is ready. It tastes great with steamed rice. Please try it in home and subscribe. Don't forget to give your valuable comments. Bye bye and take care.